Good day everyone, welcome back to our channel. Today, we're going to talk about a significant purchase made by the Philippine Army, the Sabra Light Tank. Before we start don't forget to subscribe and like our channel. Let's start. The light tank use and still in service in the Philippine Army were the British-made Scorpion Light Tank. The FV-101 Scorpion is a British light tank and armored reconnaissance vehicle. In the Combat Vehicle Reconnaissance tracked, CVR, T, family of seven armored vehicles, it was the lead vehicle and the fire support type. It was manufactured by Alvis and entered service with the British Army in 1973 before being withdrawn in 1994. Over 3,000 were produced and used as a reconnaissance vehicle or a light tank. The Philippine Army has no more than 10 Scorpion light tanks in service, some of which were used in Marawi. Elbit Systems was awarded a three-year, $172 million contract to supply the Philippine Army PA, with Sabra light tanks in January 2021. The wheeled light tank configuration is based on the Czech military vehicle exporter Excalibur Army's 88-wheeled Pander 2 platform. The Philippine Army is now equipped with the Israeli company Elbit Systems Sabra light tank. It is one of the world's first armies to employ the concept of a light tank. The Philippine Army recently launched a procurement for approximately 3,400 105mm ammunition. In the year 2015, the U.S. Army also launched the Mobile Protected Firepower MPF, program, which is a light tank concept. The United States Army launched the Mobile Protected Firepower MPF, program to improve the capabilities of its infantry brigade combat teams IBCTs, in contested environments, particularly in urban areas. The Army recognized the need for a lightweight, mobile, and heavily armored direct fire capability capable of supporting infantry operations on today's battlefield. A light tank is a type of armored vehicle designed to provide mobile direct fire support to ground troops while remaining light enough to be transported by air, rail, or road. Light tanks are smaller and less heavily armored than heavy tanks, but they are faster and more maneuverable, making them better suited for certain missions. Light tanks are typically armed with a main gun and machine guns, and they are frequently used to support infantry in urban and other confined areas, where their mobility and firepower can be especially effective. They are also used for reconnaissance and other missions that require speed and agility. The light tank concept has evolved over time, with various countries and militaries developing their own variations and classifications. Light tanks have been developed in some cases specifically for airborne operations, with features such as airdroppable designs and reduced weight for easy transport. Overall, the light tank concept reflects the need for a versatile and mobile armored vehicle capable of providing direct fire support and mobility in a wide range of combat environments. The Sabra is a light tank developed in collaboration with Elbit Systems by Israel Military Industries IMI. The tank was designed to provide the Israel Defense Forces IDF, with a highly mobile, well-armed, and well-protected light tank that can operate in a variety of combat environments. It is based on the chassis of General Dynamics Track Light Armored Vehicle LAV. A 105mm main gun, a 7.62mm coaxial machine gun, and a 12.7mm heavy machine gun are all standard on the Sabra. The tank also has advanced targeting and fire control systems, such as a laser rangefinder and a ballistic computer, allowing the crew to engage targets accurately at long distances. The Sabra has four crew members, a driver, gunner, loader, and commander. The tank has a modular armor system that can be adjusted to provide optimal protection against various threats. The tank is also intended to be highly mobile, with a top speed of more than 70 km per hour and the ability to traverse a wide range of terrain types. The Sabra light tank purchase is a significant step towards strengthening the country's national security. With this acquisition, the Philippine Army is better equipped to fulfill its duty to protect the Filipino people and the country's sovereignty. With the acquisition and deployment of Israel's Sabra light tank for the Philippine Army, is it enough to deter external aggressive action? What do you think? Write your comment at the comment section. This ends our video. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Thank you for watching. See you in the next one.